Oh no! Someone's coming! Grandpa, what is going on here? Uh oh oh hey, hey Blue Star, what are you doing so close to the two like place, Grandpa? <sighs> I I know, Lionheart. I'm I'm really sorry. Well, who is this, Grandpa? Uh, oh, don't worry. He's not going to be a threat. He's not even from the other clan. He's just here from over the fence. He lives with the two like Rusty. This is Blue Star. She's the leader of my clan. And the yellow one is Lionheart. He's my mentor. And that just means he's training me to be a warrior. Well, you fight well for a two like pet. After all, Greypaw is stronger than you and has had some training. And you even turned to face him when he chased you. I've never seen a kitty pet do that before. And you're not too bad at hunting. You might have even caught that mouse if you haven't hesitated for so long. Wait, really? Blue Star, he was hunting in a Thunder Queen territory. Just send him home. S send me home. But I only want to maybe catch a mouse. I'm sure there's enough mice to feed your clan. There's never enough mice to feed the clan. You're only a kitty pet, so you wouldn't know. You get everything you want, but here we have to fight and get our food ourselves. You know, we hunt here to survive, not for fun. I really didn't think that through. I'm really sorry. I promise I won't help here again. But seriously, is surviving here that hard? Our clan only takes a part of the forest, leaving us not that much territory to hunt. And this year, the late new Leaf means the price scarce, so we need everything that we have. So is your clan big? Yes, indeed, it is pretty big. Our territory is big enough, but there isn't that much prey at this time of year. Well, well, are you guys all worried? Some are, some are training. And you all live together and share your prey? Well, you can find these things out yourself. Would you like to join Thunder Clan? If you really did, you would trade with Greypa and possibly become a warrior. But Blue Star, he wasn't born as a clan cat. He doesn't have warrior blood. He can't just join into our clan like that. Too much of the warrior blood has been spilled. You must either live with us and join our clan or never return here again. Well, can I think about your offer? Lionheart will be here tomorrow at sunrise. You want to join our clan? Meet here tomorrow. <sighs> hey, Rusty! How was your trip to the forest yesterday? Did you catch anything? Well, you see, I, I did see some wild cats. What? Are you serious? Did you, you know, get into a fight or something? Well, you know, sort of. Did you get hurt? What really happened? Well, there were three of them. Oh my gosh, Rusty. Did you fight off all three? Of course not. I only fought off, well, one. And then two of them came a bit later just to talk. Well, how come you're still here? From what I heard, nobody comes back if they meet wildcats in the forest. Well, at first they wanted me just to leave the territory, but... Then they wanted me to or join their clan. Why the heck would they want you to join their clan? They're wildcats and you live with humans and you probably don't even want to go, right? I seriously wouldn't trust them if I were you. Well, Smudge, I've made up my mind and I'm going to go. So, this is goodbye. Are you insane, Rusty? That's such a horrible idea. W what if I never see you again? Don't worry, I'll come and visit eventually. And my housefolk will probably get another cat. You get along well with everyone, so you'll probably get along with them as well. But Rusty, I'm, I'm going to miss you. I'm sorry, Smudge. I really am. <sighs> okay, let's at least spend one more morning together.